Welcome everyone to another episode of the All Quarterback Fantasy Draft on Madden 23, where Simply just did a fantasy draft and was only able to pick quarterbacks. And in today's episode, we have a huge game as we are fighting for first place in the AFC West. We are facing off against the 10-2 Kansas City Chiefs. Obviously, they are led in this by Patrick Mahomes, 98 overall, so defense is in for quite the game. It's going to be tough. Hopefully, we can go on ahead and get the win. Here are the highlights. Situations. I want a back who can create his own space, who can break tackles, and in a sense, and in for the Chiefs touchdown. So the ball position now at the three. Here's second and goal. And that is caught. Touchdown. Samuels is into the end zone. Touchdown, Kansas City. But a big gain to boot. So it's first and goal and a great opportunity to get that lead back before. And he will take it in for the Bronco. Mahomes going to throw. And caught by Cooper for a downfield. And when they see openings, take their shots. On first down, Allen. Going down the middle, and it's complete. He'll get it inside the 20. And all the way home for a Bronco score. Matt Corral, 49 yards. And the Broncos are in downfield. And when they see openings, take their shots. On first down, Allen. Going down the middle, and it's complete. He'll get it inside the 20. And all the way home for a Bronco score. Matt Corral, 49 yards. And the Broncos are in. This for the lead in the final stages. Gonzalez's kick is good. And with a little score. Here's Allen. And he gets this one just shy of the 40 to mark him down at the 39. Throwing his Allen. And this will be incomplete. 30 yards from realistic field goal range. You want to get the ball to the 38, but preferably the 35 or less to give your guy his best shot at putting it through the posts. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. And that's going to be back in completions. Allen. And that's caught inside the 35. Here's first and 10, just outside the 30. Now Allen. That is caught inside the five. And he doesn't quite make it, taking it with it an eyelash. Dropped at the one. Huge plays on back-to-back -back snaps. So on the other side of the ball, You've got to go band of brothers' thought process. No one left behind. No pointing fingers. No accusations. In the wrong direction. Now they'll look to make amends on second and 14. Mahomes. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. And this will be caught. It's so we did not get the win. Chiefs beat us 31 to 25. But, well, I mean, looking at the stats, it, I mean, it was still a Pretty good, pretty good game. Was a close game, but forced it overtime. But sometimes an OT just doesn't go your way. They went on to win the game, but it's not that bad. Josh Allen played a pretty good game. 15 for 20, 280 yards and two touchdowns. Ritter had a good game rushing. Seven rushes for 43 yards and a touchdown. Allen rushed for 15. Tannehill, seven receptions for 100 yards and a touchdown. Driscoll, four for 84. Corral, one for 49 and a touchdown. Etling, two for 34. Willis, one for 13. Perkins did allow two sacks, but it's kind of to be expected. Tyrod Taylor and Trace McSorley led the team in tackles with six. Hogan, Smith, and Brissett led all had a tackle for loss. No sacks, no interceptions, no forced fumbles, hence the reason it was such a close game. But, positive note, we can finally kick the ball now. Felipe Franks is now finally good enough overall to where we can kick field goals, we can kick extra points. So that's drastically going to change the trajectory of the series. Sam Ellinger will be missing next week's game with a PCL sprain. And we currently sit now two games behind the Chiefs who are in first place. But we are sitting at the number four seed, well, fourth best team in the AFC, which would give us the five seed in the playoffs. 
So, right now we're in the playoffs, and it looks like the top seven, six teams are pretty much ahead in that aspect. So, I think we should make the playoffs. I think as long as somehow we don't totally collapse and lose every single game for the rest of the year, should make the playoffs and then hopefully go on to win the Super Bowl. But that is going to be it for me today. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video.